Okay, to follow along with this course, first of all, you need Visual Studio 2013 or higher. In this course, I'm using Visual Studio 2013 Community Edition, which is free. Also, I'm gonna use a few plugins to increase my productivity and make my development experience more enjoyable. So open up Visual Studio under Tools, go to Extensions and Updates. On the left side, select Online. And here, search for Visual Studio Productivity Power Tools. So you can see I have installed Productivity Power Tools 2013. This is an extension that brings in a lot of useful features to increase your productivity. Next, search for Web Essentials. Again, you can see I've installed this plugin. In your case, you will see a button to install this plugin. And the last plugin, which is optional, is ReSharper. So you don't necessarily need ReSharper to follow along with this course, but I highly recommend you to download and install it because I'm going to show you lots of time-saving tips and tricks. ReSharper is a commercial plugin and the price is somewhere about $70 to $90 a year. And I highly recommend you to invest this money and add ReSharper to your toolbox because the number of hours you will save per year will save you far more than $90 a year. And by the way, I'm not a ReSharper affiliate. I don't get a penny from promoting this. I'm just recommending ReSharper because I only teach you the best tools because I want you to be outstanding in your career. Now, whether you want to get a ReSharper license or not is your decision, but you can get a free 30-day trial version of ReSharper to try the time-saving tricks I'm going to show you in the course. And if you don't want to get ReSharper, that's perfectly fine. Don't panic. I will show you how to get things done without ReSharper as well. All right, our development environment is ready. Next, we're going to create our first MVC application. 